Hey guys, this is Sean from Shanker.com and today we are having Huawei Watch 2 with us and we are going to perform an unboxing of its retail box. We will have a look on the device, the smartwatch and what all the contents we got inside this retail box. We will be doing all of the user unboxing and first impression and stuff in this video. So let's just start it. So here is our Huawei Watch 2 retail box. It's the white retail box. Here is a beautiful shiny Huawei logo. There's nothing written on all of these sides. Here we got it's written that Huawei Watch. It's not written even that it's 2 or what. Here it is Android Wear. At the bottom we are having the model code name, color black, Huawei technology and that's what we got. So let's open the box and let's see what we got inside. So here we go. So after opening this box we can see it's written Huawei design here and in the inside it's written are you ready to experience the journey so it looks quite good but let's have a look what we got here so here is our Huawei watch 2 and there are a few more lines written that enjoy the life with us here are the accessories so this is our Huawei watch 2 nothing else here Let's take this accessory box out. Let's see what we got here. Okay. So here is a leaflet talking about Huawei Wear, Huawei Health applications. And then what else we got? Huawei Watch 2 Quick Start Guide. And then we got the charger and uh, the component, the part that we will connect to the device for charging purpose. It's exactly like the Huawei Watch 1. There is beautiful Huawei logo as well here as you can see let me take it out so you can see there is Huawei logo and uh, on the back side it just says Huawei technology and model is Leo Cradle Leo is the code name for Huawei watch 2 if you don't know and this part will go here at the bottom and then we got this charger here no need to take it out so let's keep all this stuff on the side and let's have a look on our device the smartwatch the Huawei watch 2 so here is our Huawei watch 2 the normal version there are two variants the classic and the sporty one this is the sporty one I got here so let's just switch it on okay here we go so there is the Huawei logo let me tell you something about this smartwatch while it's booting for the first time it comes with 1.2 inch AMOLED screen with 390 cross 390 pixel resolution 326 ppi there is 4 GB of internal storage 768 MB RAM and the device is having IP68 certification for being water resistance and it runs on Android Wear 2.0 and the processor used is Qualcomm Snapdragon Android Wear 2100 1.1 GHz quad core processor and it weighs just 57 gram it is having the SIM card slot as well either nano sim or e sim i'm not sure which one i got so it comes with lt capability here 
and the device is ready to be used now. So tap to begin and I need to select all this stuff here. So I will have to do the setup of this device right now. So let's have a look on the design instead of doing the setup. So we are having a thick device as you can see. Here we are having two metallic buttons. The first one is power key. The second one is a dedicated key that you can use for various purpose. Basically it is custom key for launching the application by pressing it and uh, here is the circular screen we are having this bezel which is having minutes uh, marked the lines and also the numerics the digits and if we just open it we can have a look on the back side the belt is having synthetic material it's silicon belt but there is nice lines and grooves so it feels so good and touching especially this part the back side is pretty much smooth and uh, here at the bottom you can see that we're having the heart rate sensor there is the charging connection point this is the point where you will have to connect your charger and it's written that it's made in China Mew Mew 3 I don't know <laughs> what the hell it is and uh, it says mysteriously studio coal limited so I think it's designed by those guys or something then here is the power rating 5 volt 1 amp so if you're talking about the design as I said the device is a bit thick because the screen is a bit small and this is a touch screen obviously and the bezel is a bit high raised and so while swiping the finger on the screen it's touching the bezel each time when I'm swiping even on the upward or downward so it's touching the device all the time so this is uh, something not good in the first impression I can say and also because of this uh, huge bezel the raised bezel the screen is looking even smaller it's just 1.2 inch screen and because of this extra part it's covering the screen in a way and it's making it looking smaller and uh, the device is pretty lightweight as I said so this is a very good thing about the device but it's uh, a bit thick because the screen is smaller with respect to the thickness and other than that it's looking quite good so let me do the setup of this Huawei watch 2 with a smartphone and then we will have a look on the inside of the device that what we got in it so here is our Huawei watch 2 after the settings and uh, if you just tap on this power key here then the list of application will appear so you can see that we got settings agenda alarm contacts daily tracking find my phone fade fit workout flashlight heart rate sensor messenger phone play store reminder settings stopwatch timer translate watch mode weather workout and your fit so we got workout and we got two fit applications as well that's fit and fit workout and uh, if you just press and hold an application then you can see that it's marked as favorite and if you just press and hold it once again then it will be removed from the list of favorites and then it will come in the alphabetical way and then we can go to the settings and let's have a look on few of the options we got here so the first one is display if you go there you can see that we got change watch face option and then you can adjust the brightness as well then you can select the font size whether normal, small or large. Always on screen option is there as well. You can just swipe on the right side 
go to the previous screen then there is sound and notification there is media volume you can just use this slider to select the volume you want there is alarm volume ring volume also you can select the vibration for your calls there is option to select ringtones as well and then we are having the notification preview whether you want the normal one or high priority just like our smartphones there is dnd do not disturb provided as well and there is emerging c notification and if you go to the apps you can have a look on the system apps as well and then what we got here is gesture settings so tilt to wake wrist gestures are there and there is launch tutorial options when i first did the setup when i connected this Huawei Watch 2 with my smartphone then there were some tutorials coming on the screen so you can just use this option to have a look on those tutorials once again and if you go to the connectivity we are having bluetooth wi-fi cellular nfc as i have said this is having this device is having a sim card slot nano sim card slot so because of that we are having the cellular connectivity and then there is location and airplane mode and uh, as i said that the bezel is a bit raised each time i'm swiping my thumb is touching this uh, bezel and it's a bit annoying and then we've got some accessibility feature like magnification text to speech output talk back power button and scroll just like our smartphones and then we're having the personalization option there is input method accounts customize hardware button as i said in the beginning that you can customize this button to launch some particular application and do some activity there is a smart reply and there's ok google detection as well device administration screen lock off you can set up the screen from here as well if you want and then we got some system settings like date and time disconnect and reset restart the device and switch it off so these are the features and functionality that we got on our Huawei Watch 2 in first look it's looking uh, pretty impressive because it is having lots of features it got like cellular connectivity it is having NFC heart rate sensor the screen resolution is so nice it's more than like 320 ppi 326 ppi uh, if I'm not wrong so it's very sharp and crystal clear display and the brightness is good as well there is a sensor provided for brightness detection and so uh, it can automatically adjust the brightness so this is a nice feature as well the only problem is with the design of the device we are not having any crown here as you can see we are having two metal keys metal buttons one is the power key and to access the apps another one is the uh, customized button to launch the application and then we are having this raised bezel and each time i'm swiping in any direction my fingers they are touching the bezel and it's a bit annoying as i said and the device is a bit thick it's not so thick but considering the size of the screen it's looking a bit thicker other than that everything is looking so nice especially the features and the performance is supposed to be so nice in this device and it's really looking promising so in the first impression the device is looking so powerful and the performance is looking good as well the only problem is with the design that uh, there is wrist bezel it's touching my finger all the time and the device is looking a bit thick considering the small size of the screen just 1.2 inch other than that everything is so good so this is just an unboxing and first impression video we will use this smartwatch for a while and then we will come with more review videos and we will share our feedback that how good or bad this Huawei Watch 2 is and whether you should buy it or not. So that's all for now friends. Thanks for watching the video and do not forget to subscribe the channel for more videos, tips and tricks and hands on reviews like this. And you can also get in touch with me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter by visiting the links given in the description of this video. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a nice day.